click subscribe and bell icon to get regular notifications. I am Dr. R. A. Purnachandra Tejasvi. I am an orthopedic surgeon with special interest in arthroscopic surgery, sports medicine and joint preservation. I am working with Ishoda Hospitals, Sikindrabad. Today, we will be discussing about a special branch that is arthroscopic surgery in the field of orthopedics. Arthroscopic surgery or what we commonly call as keyhole surgery or minimally invasive surgery is a type of orthopedic surgery of specific joints like shoulder, knee, hip, etc. Here, we make use of small incisions or poco holes in the skin and introduce thin long tube or a flick that is called as arthroscope into the joint. This is in turn connected to a camera which relays the images and video onto a monitor. This way, the surgeon assesses all the structures in the joint and can deal with specific problems through additional 1 or 2.05 cm incisions. By the use of high precision and specific instrumentation, the surgery is highly precise and also limits the damage to the surrounding structures to a bare minimum. This is called as arthroscopic or keyhole surgery. There are many indications for arthroscopic surgery. Previously, it was done mainly for joints like knee and the shoulder and very few problems were treated by this excellent technique. But as the technology advanced and with increased surgeon expertise, the scope and the indications for this procedure have increased. More and more procedures that were being done by conventional long incisions are being done by this technique. A classical example is the hip joint. Previously, even a minor surgery like a biopsy from the hip necessitated a 5 to 10 inch incision to access the joint. But now, this can be achieved with two small 0.5 cm incisions through this technique. But unfortunately, there are only two or three centers in the entire nation with properly trained surgeons to do this procedure. These days, we are treating even some fractures with the aid of this excellent technique. This helps us in getting good reduction of the fracture, especially at the ends of the bone and around the joint, which helps in better healing and beneficial to the patient. With right training and good equipment, keyhole surgery can be done for almost all major joints in the body, including shoulder, elbow and wrist joints in the upper limb and starting from hip till the ankle joint in the lower limb. If you consider some very common problems in the younger population, that is below 40 or 45 years of age, most of the problems that are addressed by arthroscopy include problems related to ligament tears, damage to menisci or what we call as shock absorbing structures in the joints, dislocations of the joints or multiple dislocations or involving shoulder joint, elbow, etc. Also, problems related to cartilage can be treated by this technique. In older individuals, the commonly treated problems are due to degenerative conditions such as rotator cuff tears, meniscal tears and mild osteoarthritis. There are several advantages of arthroscopic surgery compared to open surgery. In the period before surgery, the amount of preparation to be done by the patient is generally lower and the pre-operative investigations are generally less. During the surgery per se, we use minute incision and there is no need for blood transfusions. The surgical time is usually reduced which limits the anesthetic drugs required. Due to less soft tissue dissection and damage to the surrounding structures, the post-operative pain is less and the recovery is quicker. Due to three-dimensional assessment of the structures and pathology, the level of precision and treatment is usually higher. The arthroscope can be guided into tight spaces which allows the surgeon to tackle even those problems which are usually not visible to the naked eye. This makes the treatment complete and the benefit of which can be transferred to the patient. After the operation, this reduces the hospital stay and there is less post-operative pain. There is decreased chance for infections. Also, the patient has faster recovery. Since we go directly into the disease site with minimal disturbance to the normal structures and there is minimal dissection of the 
tissues pain is usually less and recovery after surgery is usually faster when compared to the open surgery most of the patients in fact are treated on day care basis as most of these procedures are done on an elective basis the patient is evaluated in advance by the surgeon and the anesthetist and is advised to come to the hospital on the day of surgery with 6 hours of fasting the surgery is usually done on the same day morning and most of the patients are discharged on the day of surgery this is called as day care surgery few patients especially the elder people and those from outside the city are discharged the following day for most of the procedures the patient can start walking the next day and doing all day to day activities within a day or two these people those people who have desk jobs or office jobs can usually return to work by 10 to 12 days activities like jogging or cycling can be started by 3 weeks usually usually the patient is gradually trained to take increasing stress on the operated joint and progressively introduced to sports it may take anywhere between 6 months to 1 year to fully return to sports at the same level of activity before the injury or surgery which again depends on the severity of the initial problem and the progress of the rehabilitation program since arthroscopy involves special equipment and there is a lot of equipment needed for which investment goes into initial cost is usually higher than the open surgery which is usually around 10 to 20% uh, expensive than the conventional surgery but the cost of surgery cannot be seen in isolation and we consider the total cost involved for the patient the pre operative investigations needed the amount of physical rehabilitation needed post surgery and the total rest from work needed all the above are less in arthroscopic surgery when compared to con- open or conventional surgeries in fact many studies have been conducted to study this aspect and have found that even though arthroscopic surgery is expensive initially but when we add all the costs combined that is including the pre operative expenses the increased hospital stay the post operative rest required and uh, the absence from work the cost effective analysis or the cost benefit study shows that arthroscopic surgery is much more beneficial to the patient further there are the, the studies have shown less number of complications or like decreased chances of infection decreased stiffness of the joint in the arthroscopic surgery compared to conventional surgery all these things taken into account make arthroscopic surgery much more beneficial to the patient in general if you have any questions you can contact us at ashoda hospitals thank you